Ever popped open a bubbly drink and wondered, are these bubbles good for me or a sneaky health villain? Get ready to dive into the fizzy world of carbonated water. We'll explore its journey from bubbling springs to your glass, untangling the mysteries of seltzer, club soda, and even fancy sparkling mineral water. We'll crack open the code on their health benefits and hidden downsides, like a detective of the drink world. So, what clues has the body shown? <sighs> we don't need clues. So buckle up, we're about to find out if your favorite fizzy friend is a hydration hero or a calorie culprit in disguise. This bubbly investigation might just change your next sip. Now that we've sparked your curiosity, let's dive into the heart of the matter. What exactly is carbonated water? Let's bubble into the details and discover its fizzy identity. Think of water as a shy wallflower, all plain and quiet. Now imagine this wallflower meeting a supercharged gas called carbon dioxide. Poof! They become the dynamic duo of carbonated water. The gas gets trapped inside, tickling and fizzing, creating those bubbles we love. But there's more to this bubbly story. Carbonated water comes in two main flavors, globetrotting and DIY. Globetrotting, this rock star comes straight from mineral springs like a spa for water. Each sip is a mini vacation bursting with natural minerals and gases. It's like a bottled adventure. DIY, think of this as the build your own fizz version. Normal water gets pumped up with carbon dioxide gas and boom, instant bubbles. It's the quick and easy way to get your fizz fix. But wait, there's a whole fizzy family waiting to meet you. Seltzer, this chill dude is like sparkling water's laid back cousin. Just bubbles and maybe a hint of fruitiness. Perfect for a quick refresh or a sneaky soda substitute. Club soda, imagine seltzer with a dash of salt and extra minerals. That's club soda, the secret weapon in many cocktails. It adds a bit of sparkle and complexity to your drink. Sparkling mineral water. This is the real deal, the OG of fizz. Naturally carbonated from springs, it's like a mineral-packed treasure hunt in every bottle. Each brand offers a unique taste adventure, so get ready to explore. Tonic water. This rebel of the bunch brings a bitter twist with quinine and a touch of sweetness. You'll usually find it hanging out with gin, adding some drama and depth to the party. Okay, we've got the fizzy facts down. Now let's dive into the most exciting part, how this bubbly magic can actually be good for you. First things first, carbonated water is a hydration superstar. It quenches your thirst just like plain water but with a fun bubbly twist. If gulping down regular water feels like a chore, a glass of fizz might be the trick to keeping you hydrated all day. Plus, for those who find plain water a bit boring, it's a calorie-free and sugar-free way to make staying hydrated a party. Addison, stay hydrated. Hi. Yep. Hydrated. 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 <laughs> Tummy troubles? Fizz to the rescue. For the folks who struggle with digestion, Carbonated water can be your new best friend. It can actually make swallowing easier, especially for older adults or anyone who has a bit of trouble getting things down smoothly. If you ever feel that dreaded indigestion coming up, a glass of bubbly can bring some sweet relief. Weight Management Wizard. Here's a tip for the weight conscious crew. Carbonated water might help you feel full for longer. The bubbles make it feel like you're eating more even when you're not, so it can be a smart swap in a balanced diet. Especially if you're watching your calorie intake. Just remember, it's a teammate, not a magic potion. Bone and Heart Health Hero Moving on to your bones and heart, some carbonated waters packing minerals like calcium and magnesium could be like a secret weapon. Studies have shown they might lower your risk of heart disease and guess what? They don't weaken your bones like some people think. Those minerals can actually give them a little boost. Circulation and Relaxation Champion Feeling stressed and in need of a day spa? Some research suggests that a soak in slightly warm carbonated water can give your blood flow a little boost. It's like a mini vacation for your skin and circulation without the hassle of leaving the house. Mineral Marvel. And let's not forget the minerals. Mineral water comes loaded with good stuff like phosphorus, calcium, potassium, and magnesium. These aren't just fancy words, they're essential for keeping your body working its best. From blood clotting to strong bones. I am invincible! Invincible! You yeah. oh! Okay, we've seen the bubbly bright side, but let's face it. Everything has a shadow, even our fizzy friend. I don't know what's going on here, but don't be throwing things because that's just not safe. So let's crack open the potential downsides of carbonated water and see what might be lurking beneath the bubbles. 
For peeps with sensitive tummies or IBS, carbonated water can be a bit of a party pooper. It might cause bloating, discomfort, and even play a confusing game of constipation and loose stools. Sweetener Sneaky Sneaky this is where things get tricky. Some fizzy waters come with hidden guests, artificial sweeteners. Even though they say zero calories, they might be messing with your gut health, blood sugar, and even leading to unwanted weight gain. So be a label detective and steer clear of these sneaky sweeteners. Sodium Saga. If you're on team low sodium, be wary of certain carbonated waters like club soda. These can pack a salty punch, which isn't ideal if you're managing blood pressure or keeping sodium in check. Chemical Conundrum Some sparkling waters might have a secret ingredient nobody wants, PFAS chemicals. These unwanted guests are linked to health issues like liver problems and even messing with your immune system and thyroid. They're like the uninvited guests to the carbonated water party. <laughs> Raising concerns about long-term health effects. Brain Buzz on a cool note, research suggests that carbonated water can actually boost blood flow and brain power, especially in hot weather. This means it could give you a little extra mental oomph compared to plain water. So while carbonated water can be a fun and refreshing drink, it's important to be a smart sipper. You're almost ready to have your next sip. But before that, let's clear up some common myths that might be clouding your sparkling water experience. Time to separate the fizzy facts from the fizzy fables. Myth number one, fizz is less healthy than flat water. Fact, not true. Plain carbonated water is just as hydrating and good for you as still water. The real trick is to choose options without sneaky sugars or chemical nasties. Myth number two, bubbles are bad for my teeth. Fact, plain sparkling water is usually teeth friendly way better than sugary drinks. But those fancy flavors, especially the citrusy ones, can wear down your enamel a bit. So sip them in moderation and stick to plain fizz more often. Myth number three, carbonated water gives me the grumbles. Fact, some folks with sensitive tummies or conditions like IBS might feel some bloat and discomfort after bubbly sips. If fizzy water doesn't agree with your gut, sticking to plain water is a safer bet. Myth number four, fizz steals my bone density. Fact, nope, plain carbonated water won't mess with your bones. The bone health worries are mainly about sodas with phosphoric acid, which you won't find in plain sparkling water. Myth number five, label reading is a bubbly bummer. Fact, not at all, it's your ticket to healthy fizz. Look for low calorie, chemical free and sugar free options. Watch out for added sugars, fake sweeteners and any suspicious sounding acids. And remember, moderation is your bubbly BFF so balance your fizz with some good old-fashioned water. Myth number six, fizz makes me a bottomless pit. Fact, some studies suggest a possible link between fizz and increased hunger, but it's not a clear picture yet. More research needed on that bubbly hunger connection. Myth number seven, all fizz is created equal? Fact, not at all. Club soda has extra minerals, tonic water is all about the quinine and sugar, and flavored fizzes might have added sweeteners and flavors. The key is to choose varieties without harmful stuff to get the best health benefits from your bubbles. I am the one, the one you're to... And with this, we have come to the end of our fizzy exploration. And let me tell you, carbonated water is one drink packed with both perks and quirks. It's like a story with exciting heroes and sneaky villains, all wrapped up in a refreshing bubble. Avengers! Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this bubbly adventure, hit that like button and subscribe for more fun and informative videos like this. Cheers. <laughs>